some hidden tips and tricks for the Google Pixel 6 and the Google Pixel 6 Pro running Android 12. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you some hidden tips and tricks for the Google Pixel 6 and the Google Pixel 6 Pro running Android 12. Now, most of you would know if you go into settings about Android version, tap on the Android version a few times, you do get the Android Easter egg. Now with Android 12, if you rotate this clock to 12, you do get some colors but after this if you go back to your home screen press and hold on the empty space go into widgets you will have another android s easter egg and this one here is called paint chips you can of course expand this and once you expand it it will show you the colors which are being used in the current material you theme tap on it you will get more options tap on it and you can now share them with your contacts or using messages or using email using android 12's quick share menu and while we are still talking about widgets let us go back and go into clock for starters if you bring up any of these digital ones you do get the option of choosing a solid background or a transparent background and if you bring over the analog one you get multiple clock faces so you can choose between four different clock faces let us choose the numeral one and of course you can press and hold on this and then tap on the edit icon to change the clock face in case you want to but super interesting thing if you move the widget around the wallpaper itself you will notice that it is changing the color based on that of the background within this specific wallpaper which again i think is a pretty nifty and a pretty dope touch by google next up if this content in the at a glance widget irritates you you can always go into home settings at a glance and choose what all content you want to see and what all content you don't want to see in your at a glance widget now unfortunately you cannot press and hold and remove the widget and the same applies for the search bar as well those i think are two features which i would want google to add to this pixel launcher next hidden feature we can talk about is system wide search so if i open my application drawer for starters you will notice that the keyboard is popping up automatically that you can change by tapping on the three dot menu on the top right always hide keyboard and now when i open the application drawer keyboard is not showing up however if you tap on this search bar type in anything it is going to show you your contacts and if you search for say youtube over here then you can get the option of search subscriptions explore and of course all of this can be customized go into preferences here it is you can configure what all content you want to see in your system wide search next up if you are on the move a lot and are getting irritated with public wi-fi network notification go into settings network and internet and here in tap on internet go into the network preferences and here is the toggle notify for public networks i have turned this toggle off because it is kind of irritating when you keep getting notifications for an open public wi-fi network all the time next up for those of you who like to keep track of your notifications you can always enable notification history so you can go into settings notification notification history here it is enable this toggle and you are going to get your notification history of course you can access this from your quick settings as well once you swipe down if you have a notification over here on the bottom left you will have the option of history then of course with android 12 they have given you the option of choosing your precise location or exact location but what if you have already done that and now you want to change it how do you do that well it is as easy as going into settings location and then go into app location preferences go into the application here it is you do have a toggle to enable or disable your precise location and you can do this for all the applications which have had access to your location then you have some hidden features in your display settings so let us go into the display section and here and if you go into your screen timeout you have something called screen attention so let us say you are watching some content on your screen your timeout is set as 15 seconds or you are reading something not scrolling 
enable this the phone is going to check whether you're looking at the phone or not and if you are then it is not going to time out your screen after whatever duration you have chosen over here then another nifty feature which you can enable is go into the lock screen and here then you have something called now playing and once you have enabled it it is going to show you the name and the artist of the song which is being played nearby on your lock screen you also have a toggle to enable the search button on your lock screen and along with that you have now playing history as well in case you want to track down what song you heard at the club the other day then if you go into the auto rotate screen option you have something called enable face detection so this again is going to use the front camera to improve your auto rotate accuracy again images are never stored or sent to the google server for those of you who are worried about your privacy then if you go into sound and vibration here then you have something called adaptive sound and once you enable this it is going to improve the sound quality from your phone speaker it is going to use the microphone to assess the acoustics around you and then adjust it automatically again a pretty nifty feature from google then you also have a feature for your emergency sos so you can go into the settings option and here and you can search for emergency sos so if you type in emergency you're going to get this option of emergency sos when you open it for the first time you will have to set it up and then you can choose what you want to do do you want to play an alarm sound call the emergency services share information with your contacts record an emergency video now how do you enable this emergency mode all you have to do is press the power button rapidly five times there it is you just heard it i pressed it rapidly five times went into emergency mode gave me five seconds to determine whether i want to call the cops or not and lastly for the next two hidden features we will have to enable developer options so how do you do that you can go into settings then you go into about phone once you're in about phone scroll all the way down tap on the bill number a few times maybe like seven times you will get a message you are now a developer and if you have a pin or password setup you might have to enter that then you can go back go into system and herein are your developer options so now we have enabled developer options the options which i am talking about our first one is force refresh rate so again go into your settings tap on this search option and here and we can search for force so you're going to get the option of force peak refresh rate now this is for those of you who want to run your display at 120 all the time for all the applications enable this toggle and do note it is going to result in some battery drain but you do get improved touch responsiveness and animation quality then the next one again go into search and herein we have to search for the word always once you search for always you will get something like mobile data always active so this toggle is enabled by default and it is keeping your mobile data active even when the wi-fi is active for fast network switching me personally I would just like to turn that off to save some battery but then again it is a personal preference and there it is peeps those were some hidden features hidden tips and tricks for the google pixel 6 and the google pixel 6 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you